a function f is called periodic if there's a positive number p such that whenever theta is in the domain of f so is theta plus p and we say f of theta plus p is equal to f of theta the smallest value of p is called the fundamental period of f periodic properties sine cosine cosecant and secant have a period of 2 pi tangent and cotangent have a period of pi we're going to find the exact value of 17 pi over 4 using periodic properties 17 pi over 4 is equal to 16 pi over 4 plus pi over 4 and 16 pi over 4 is 4 pi 4 pi plus pi over 4 4 pi is 2 times 2 pi 2 times is the period plus pi over 4 so it's 2 revolution plus pi over 4 so sine will be the same sine 17 pi over 4 will be the same as sine pi over 4 we will look at the reference triangle to find the value of pi, sine pi over 4 it's the 1 1 square root of 2 triangle sine pi over 4 is 1 over square root of 2 when rationalized square root of 2 over 2 5 pi is equal to 4 pi which is 2 times 2 pi plus pi cosine 2 times 2 pi 2 times the period plus pi is equal to cosine pi therefore cosine 5 pi is equal to let's look at the unit circle and we realize that for pi the coordinates are negative 1 0 and cosine is x so cosine 5 pi is equal to negative 1 5 pi over 4 is equal to 4 pi over 4 plus pi over 4 5 pi over 4 is equal to pi which is the period of tension plus pi over 4 now tangent pi plus pi over 4 is equal to tangent pi over 4 therefore tangent 5 pi over 4 is equal to looking at the reference triangle tangent pi over 4 which is 1 over 1 so the answer is 1 checkpoint what's the period of cosine what's the period of cosine x cosine x is equal to cosine parenthesis x plus 2 pi x plus a full revolution therefore the period is 2 pi what's the period of y equal to tangent x 
tangent x if we go half a revolution from first to third quadrant we get the same tangent so it's tangent x plus pi we don't have to do a full revolution so the period is pi now if sine a is equal to two-thirds then we know that sine a is equal to sine a plus two pi because the period is two pi so sine a plus two pi is equal to two-thirds if tangent beta is equal to negative three we know that tangent beta is equal to tangent beta plus k pi k must be an integer in this situation k is equal to negative one tangent beta is equal to tangent beta minus pi which is negative three.